Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel, and if you're new, then welcome to my channel. I'm Cami. Okay, so today's video is going to be a what's for dinner. So today's video is also going to be a collab with Crystal Evans here on YouTube, and I will put her Instagram right here, and then a screen recording of her YouTube channel right here. So definitely make sure to go and check her video out whenever you're done watching mine. She's super amazing, and she makes, like, meal inspiration videos all of the time and what's for dinners and all of that kind of stuff and they always look super super delicious so i definitely recommend checking out her channel which will be linked down below so after you're done watching this video definitely make sure to check out her channel and if you're coming from her channel then thank you so much and i hope that you will consider subscribing to my channel i know i don't look very cute for this intro but i'm about to clean my house so yeah I hope that you guys enjoy this video and if you're new, please subscribe and let's just get into this what's for dinner. So this first meal is hamburgers and fries and I just use these frozen fries and I season them with some season oil and put those in the oven. Then I use some pre-made patties that I had gotten from a Walmart and season those. And I just added some Worcestershire sauce and some hamburger seasoning and kind of just rub that all around into these patties as I spill my sauce. So as those were cooking, I just put my bun on the stovetop. I buttered it and put it on the stovetop. We used brioche buns and then I added some cheese onto our burgers. So they were cheeseburgers because we love cheese. And this is what they turned out to look like and they were just super delicious. Burgers are always yummy. This next meal is just some crock pot ribs. I have never done ribs in the crock pot before so I decided to try it out with these country style ribs. I just added some barbecue seasoning onto those and of course I had it to add some of my favorite seasoning which is Slappy Mama and I also added some pepper. So these are what they look like about halfway cooked and then I just added some barbecue sauce. This is the kind that we use for ribs, it's the Sweet Baby Rays and those sat on there for a good amount of time and then I got my asparagus ready as a side. I just oiled them up and added my favorite seasonings to them.
So after the ribs were done in the crock pot, I just took them out and added some more barbecue seasoning. Now these were extremely tender compared to doing them into the oven so they easily fell apart. But we really enjoyed it and thought it was delicious. So I will probably stick to buying a rack of ribs and just doing them in the oven like I usually do. Now this was the more complicated thing I made, but it was still extremely easy. So I got out my Dutch oven and I added some vegetable oil and then I added my meat and my onion. I also added some garlic and then I mashed that all around and let it brown everything together. So after everything was brown, I added some light red kidney beans to the mix of meat and onions. Then I added some seasoned black beans. Next I added some medium thick and chunky salsa, just the entire jar. And then I added some white wine, this is just the wine that I had picked up. I had never cooked with wine before so this made me feel fancy. This was a new recipe to us, so I'm just making sure I'm doing it right. I'm looking at a little cookbook my grandma gave me for Christmas. I added some green chilies and then I added some chili powder.
Then I added a little bit of chopped jalapeno peppers. Next I added some crushed tomatoes. Then I added some cumin. Then I just mixed everything around and let that simmer for a while in the pot. It was supposed to be like a Mexican style chili. I'm sure you could find a similar recipe online. We served ours with some cheese and sour cream. This obviously made a lot, so we ate it for leftovers and my husband took it to work, but it was definitely good. I hope you guys enjoyed this what's for dinner and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you go check out Crystal's channel, which is linked down below. Thanks for watching.